What's groovin' folks, and welcome back to BowMaths. Today, me and my buddy Kieran, aka VapeMemes2020, decided to go on a journey to A&W and do some math. Here's our story. So, why am I talking about A&W? Well, back in the 1980s, A&W released a little ad campaign where they released a third pounder burger. Now, you may know from McDonald's, they have quarter pounder burgers. So A&W made the third pounder burger basically the same price as the McDonald's one. And they said, okay, well, a third is bigger than a fourth. We know this because the ones on the numerator, right, that's the same. So we just have to compare the denominators. The larger the denominator, remember, that means the smaller the fraction because we're dividing that one into more pieces. So uh, A&W knew this, right? They're like, yeah, we got some fraction knowledge here. So they said, okay, we're gonna sell a third pounder burger, that's more meat, right, for the same price. People are gonna love it. But the thing is, they didn't do very well because people didn't really know their math. They saw four and they said, hey, that's bigger than three, so therefore a quarter is bigger than a third. But boy, were they wrong, and they missed out on one steal of a deal. That's really good. To be honest, I don't know why I have Vape Memes 2020 in this video. I just needed someone to film me, I guess. <laughs> now, a lot of people know that A&W story. However, what they don't necessarily know is that actually fairly recently, like a couple years ago, A&W actually tried to capitalize on this campaign by releasing a three-ninths pounder burger. Because three-ninths, right, that's equivalent to one-third, both three and nine. If we divide them by three to make an equivalent fraction, we get one over three. So they said, oh, three ninths. I mean, Americans love that. It's got a three and a nine in it. Those are massive numbers, right? So they figured they could trick people into uh, seeing that, um, you know, bring back the third pounder, but with expressed as an equivalent fraction where it's a bigger number. And then that would surely beat the quarter pounder. Fractions, you know, it's, it's tough out there. It's tough out there. But luckily, we, we got probably know more. Yeah, exactly. That's the bow mass difference. That's what that is the bow mass difference. That's what I always say. <laughs> so, if people thought a third was smaller than a quarter, then one could reasonably think that A and W could start selling one fifth pounder burgers and charging more for it. We know that a fifth is less than a fourth, so they'd be basically selling you less meat but charging more, and people would buy it because they think a fifth is bigger than a fourth, right? So see, that's also how you could use fractions to scam people. So next time you uh, start a burger business or something, why don't you try that out and see if it works for you. Um, if you run into legal trouble, don't uh, blame me for it. Hey Josh, you wanna start a burger business? Now you're thinking, screw being a mathematician. For real. A few moments later. Mm -mm -mm. What a scrumptious meal we just indulged in there. Um, indeed, so indeed. what's the, the takeaway from today? Make sure that you uh, know your fractions, how to order fractions, because sometimes it can royally screw you up. Sometimes you get, yeah. you know, you get, uh, you can, you can miss out on a lot if you yeah. don't know your fractions. You miss you know? out on a cheaper burger with more meat in it, man. Like, yeah. Yeah. And not even half bad. Yeah. So. And now that you know that it's uh, your responsibility to educate others by sending them the links to Bow Mass videos, of course. For real, for real. For real. All right. Well, I've been Bow Mass. I've been Vape Memes 2020. Go check out his channel if you haven't. Or don't. I don't really care. 
Um, I care. I care immensely. Check out the channel now. I'm cutting that. <laughs> you have a good one. You stay groovy. And I'll see you in the next video. No, oh, whatever. I got a burger out of it. You paid for it. Not yet. Oh, yeah, true. You owe me. Sweet potato fry. That would be very. I'm just gonna have you actual rat bastard. I hate you. Yes. When when has math ever related to things like surface area and volume? Math has literally nothing to do with that. I fear for your soul. <laughs> Getting his exercise, little boy. Bow maths.